Around 1970 onwards, there was just this explosion of chain of black music. Britain has continually affected the musical world. The generation just wanted to be heard. We all just came out there together and delivered this style. It, it really broke down barriers. A lot of kids that were born in this country who happened to come from African Caribbean descent wanted to make music. Half things, a combination of cultures, a whole combination of different things that we're listening to, and we were making our own heroes. There was just us. These sounds were actually good for you. They were a tonic and they were up uplifting, and that's what we should be sharing with people. You wouldn't find black people in the charts or black music in the charts. All the black music that we'd hear would be coming from America, we'd be inspired by it. And I think we we're all quite patriotic in like, come on, we can do this for England. There's a lot of black talent out there. It needs to be brought out and brought forward. To London, we were very lucky because we had a very, very strong club scene. People went out to dance, not to fight, not to stab people up, not to shoot, not to do this, not to do this, but out to dance. And we became known on the circuit as the punk reggae band. In a lot of ways, we were very different to our counterpart, which at the time, which was Aswad. At the time, how you were promoted, the budget that was put behind you, was entirely determined by your skin color. The 80s was more than just a fashion, more than just a music, it was an attitude. Soul to Soul it was a way of life. It didn't matter whether you were black or white, it really mattered in whether the music was good. English is not the common language, music is the common language. Overcomes everything. Flashback is something that takes you where you've never been before and brings you back. But it has great memories, positive memories. It shows you, as a child, that you don't have to be on a council estate being part of a gang with knives and guns. And so it's a great opportunity to really be yourself, which a lot of kids today don't have, because they're, they're absolutely knee-deep in peer pressure. I'm very glad I learned about respect and values. Education is so important. I don't only think it's important that black people learn about black history. I think it's important that everybody learns about history and full history. It's lovely that you are actually putting this together. And we need it. It's the history. It's going to be good for all, everybody and the youngsters to see, all the different artists. Yeah, I, well done, guys. <laughs> It's just an illusion